Hola, hola, hola. We return to our dear Henry in Silent Hill. We've come to make a fool of ourselves once more in this prison that I think we were in. Oh god, we were in prison. That's great. Water prison world. <laughs> Okay, what was I going? I have a pipe, a golf club, and a gun. Thing on the radio. No, not the books. And next Ooh. we'll be taking a look at the weather. Tonight we can expect scattered clouds clearing by morning. Tomorrow looks to be quite a nice day with a warm and sunny weather continuing through the evening and the weekend we can expect more of the same. So I hope you all get out there and uh, enjoy your weekend. That was it. Well, I'm not getting out and enjoying anything except prison. It's out here. Woo She's still fighting with that bug. It's time to go get some raid. That thing is really taking a toll on her. And what's over here? Creepy bunny, check. All right. Okay. Uh, I don't like this prison. Really didn't want to go back. Ugh. Not sure. Oh wait, didn't I turn that um water stuff on? Maybe I can I'm not sure exactly what I'd oh. Let's go see if that worked, I guess.
can check this floor out, I guess. the door Ooh, with the hole I jumped out. Okay. I've been watching the surveillance room's peephole the whole time and sometimes he's there. I can tell because I see a shadow move or hear his footsteps. Okay. Okay. <laughs> I'm not entirely certain what my objective here is. What's, what's this? Black powder. Okay. <laughs> I love how Henry just looks at those slugs on the wall. Ah! Gross. I gotta wash them so nobody finds out. Oh, I just saw a shadow. I think someone saw me. So, what kind of prison is this? Okay. I'm very, very confused. Um, hang on. Okay, so I know I went... I'll figure it out. Try some of these other holes, I guess. Okay. Um. Hey, where were those bullets? Oh, that thing's still here. Can't believe I couldn't, like, read any of this. I still gotta grab those bullets from those angry monsters. takes me. <sighs> Nothing. Oh my god. <sighs> Was this door locked? Oh. Okay. looking at 
I'm being watched from the middle room. Okay, I get it. None of this is helpful to me. Like, none of this is helpful to me. Okay. Yeah, 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 yeah. I get it, I get it, I get it, I get it. Okay, I get it. I'm trying, alright? I don't know what I'm doing. I don't know what my objective is. <laughs> I'm just running around. I have no idea what I'm even supposed to be doing here. I really don't. No clue. Whatsoever. Alright, let's try... Anything useful. Anything. Anyone. <sighs> this guy's so gonna be dead by the time I find the key. Ooh. Wait. Didn't I already? lost my mind. Ah! Ah! God! Ah! 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 Where am I? Oh, crap. Ah! Stay away from me! Taking them. I'm about to go try again, too. You know, just uh, as soon as I heal up and save, so I don't have to do all that again in case they do kill me. What's going on out here now? Oh my god, Eileen, you need to stop. It's getting out of hand. Going on out now. Nothing interesting. We're almost healed up. The 
fascinating. Okay, ready to go. All right, let's go kill those things. Right after I check on the bunny. Okay, okay, everything's normal. Got it. Oh, I need to put my bullet. Okay. I hate that they stack in the box, but not in my inventory. That's kind of annoying. Alright. Let's do it. Ready. Sir, I would like to look around. Because that's what I do. And that was all for not. Excellent. That's great. Okay, well, you know, I still feel vindicated. Ugh. Well. That looks ominous. Mm, I guess. Ooh. Ooh. Who else is here? I do not like this. I don't know. This place continues to deteriorate. The doors to a number of cells no longer open. As a result, the kids inside can no longer go outside. But the less they know about that, the better. I can't open the doors, but from this room, I can watch them get more and more emaciated each day. With no food and ever showering themselves, they turn into smelly little gray lumps in there. Oh my god. Following the suggestion of an engineer, we've disposed of the corpses by digging a hole below the cells. Since each floor of this building can be rotated into Independently, we can disperse of the bodies without the others noticing by lining each cell with a body in it vertically. P.S. Chief, I bet you're just dying to see the interrogation room behind the kitchen. I understand your feelings, but have you noticed? There are three rooms with bloody beds. One is on the first floor, one is on the second floor, and one is on the third floor. If you line those three rooms up, then it's bingo. Okay. Three bloody beds, eh? Okay. Um, what floor am I on now? I don't even know. Oh, first floor. Thanks. Okay. But how do I, uh... Creepy! <laughs> hey. What is that? Hey, how's it going? Okay. That one's got a bloody bed. And a chute. I do not like this place. Oh, hey! Scared me. How's it doing? He's, he's gonna kill me. 
Walter's gonna kill me. Look, buddy, I'm trying, man. Okay, I'm trying here, sort of. I'm trying very slowly. Forgot which one was the bloody bed. Not that one. I don't know if I need to remember. That's the one with the noose. That's the... Uh, not that one. This one. So... Which room? Eh. Whatever. Okay. Go up. Let's see what we got here. Oh. Ooh, there's a turny wheel thing. To keep a close eye on the kids, it's important to keep the cells well lit. The lights on the third floor were originally bought as searchlights. As a precaution against a blackout, they were set up to run on a private generator. There's a hydroelectric generator in the basement. To light up the first and second floors, use the corpse disposal chutes. Since each floor of this building can be rotated, you can light up any of the cells by matching up the holes. Repeating this periodically is an effective way to keep the kids fearful and well-behaved. <laughs> P.S. Chief. If you turn the handle in the middle of this room, you can easily rotate the cells. You can't rotate the first floor. Oh, okay. So align the second and third floors with the first floor cell that has a bloodstained bed. By the way, if you use the peephole in this room, it's easy to make sure you're doing it right. Give it a try. Also, please don't forget to open the sluice gate on the roof. Much appreciated. Okay, I already did that. Um. Okay. So the bloody bed needs to be here, I think. I think. Okay. I think it's that one. This is gonna get annoying. <laughs> oh, this is gonna take forever. Okay. Not yet. Which way did I turn it? If I keep turning it the same way. Nope. Now I know I could just find the bloody bed. And then count it up, but you know, I'd rather I like doing things the hard way. <sighs> oh, not the right one, right? Okay. Am I accomplishing anything? I don't know. Um, I think we got it on this floor. The secret number for getting through the door in the back of the kitchen this month is 0302. 0302, okay. Helpful, thanks. Um, this one, right? Whew. That is creepy. Yeah. <laughs> um, okay. Yuck.
Okay, I need to get that one over two. So let's try that. Ooh, oh crap, what happened? Hey. I don't know still if I really wanted to uh, let him out. But I don't think that's right. Okay. Um, where's the kitchen? <laughs> they don't even really know what I'm doing. Can't get out of here, huh? kid doing here. Who is that boy? And who are you? His name's Walter. Walter what? Sullivan. I used to work at the orphanage watching the kids. What? I'm Andrew DeSalvo. They tried to make it seem like an orphanage, but according to that town's holy scriptures, it was actually the center of their religion. And that kid, Walter. He was really into that mumbo jumbo. Especially that descent of the Holy Mother business. Oh, it's scary. Oh, God. Oh. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. <laughs> what? Oh crap. That's great. Where's the where am I what am I doing? Where am I going? Where's the kitchen? Didn't I unlock that door? Oh, I really want out of here. <laughs> Not like this place. Hello. Um, so, um, So that little orphan boy is Walter Sullivan, the axe murderer. Is that what you're telling me? <laughs> okay. Hmm. I'm really confused. <laughs> oh my god. I'm so confused. Eileen, help me. 
Did you win the war against that bug? I need to know. Hello? Hello? Just gonna sit here and stare at you. What's going on? What are you even doing? Hello? I'm bored with you. What's going on out here? man clean. Jeez. Um, maybe you should be more worried about the handprints on the wall, buddy. Just a thought. Just a thought. Okay. Okay, coffee time. Because I don't know what I'm doing. I don't know what I'm doing. I'm very confused. So let's take a break and then come back and try to figure out this whole Walter thing because it is getting really, uh, really complex.